So my name is Fernando Martí and I'm one of the artists with Just Seeds. So Just Seeds is a cooperative of artists working around the US, Canada, and Mexico. Uh, we work on social justice artwork, primarily printmaking, so mostly posters that we make uh, in collaboration with and in support of uh, marginalized and oppressed communities around uh, the US and around the world. We do other things, so but primarily we're printmakers, so I think that's a lot of what we're known for. So Just Seeds has a website where we sell our prints, mostly screen prints that each artist makes um, then sells through there. Uh, we do a lot of portfolios of prints for particular causes or for particular themes or um, in partnership with organizations. So we've done things around, for example, in support of the Zapatista Liberation. Uh, we've done stuff around um, climate justice and prison uh, abolition. Um, some of our members also do other things besides uh, being printmakers. Uh, so we have filmmakers and muralists uh, who are also part of the, um, the group. Uh, about a year and a half ago, a lot of us traveled to Mexico and worked in collaboration with uh, uh, various groups of printmakers in Mexico doing, doing work there. Uh, members of Just Seeds have been involved in a variety of uh, art builds, so doing uh, art in, uh, here in Chicago um, together with CTU, with the Chicago uh, uh, Teachers Union. Uh, but also uh, in Oakland and Los Angeles around teacher strikes. Many of um, Just Seeds members were part of art builds in, uh, um, around No, no Dapple. Uh, so there's that sort of, so, so there's the printmaking itself, but you know, the, the, the actual artwork, but there's the making of the art together with uh, movements. That's also a really important part of what we do. My name is Kevin Kaplicki. I'm a member of the Just Seeds Artist Cooperative based in New York City and the Hudson Valley. Um, some of the ones that stand out the most for me are the Uprisings exhibition, I believe it was called. It was at the University of Wisconsin in Milwaukee. And it was concurrent with a, a more academic um, printmaking conference called the SGC. And um, we had turned the gallery into a studio where we where we print, we all brought our designs, and we actually screen printed them in the studio during during the a week of events that we that we set up about printmaking and politics, and um, they were large scale prints. They were on sheets of paper that were like two foot by three foot, and they were all about our interpretations of of labor and about labor, and it was a it was a really fun collaboration because we were all like it took two people to pull the, the, the squeegee and like another person to pick up the screen and and to remove the paper so it was a it was a really it was a cooperative event where we we're making all the, the print that the prints that then eventually got hung up all around the space so that was a really fun one I am not a trained artist I didn't go to school to learn printmaking it's the artist cooperative tends to be my university and uh, there are all, all the mem different members that have taught me various different crafts. So learning from the different the other members has given me an opportunity to express myself politically and being involved in different organizing and, and activist campaigns. I was able, I have been able to to bring creative skills or, or like creative expression for in, in service of those campaigns. So if it's like painting banners or making puppets or doing uh, like just creating other props that would then be used in in demonstrations or uh, in actions so it's kind of like a it's my direct link to my politics so